Now the natural question arises that once the port is in this error disable state, which we saw when we have the uh, shutdown violation mode enabled on some particular port of the switch, then how to recover from that situation? So once we are in this error disabled mode, this can be recovered by one of the following methods. So first method is that we go to that particular interface which is in this state. So we go to that particular interface and then we manually shut it down first by using shutdown command and then we say no shutdown. So in this case, after these commands, this will that port will again be enabled. And then for completeness, you can see we also have this command where we can enable automatic recovery for that port. And for that, we have error disable recovery and then we give the, the cause of that violation and with this we can configure the port to automatically recover from this state and then if you want to say that port should recover after certain times for some specific time so we can say that we can enable recovery for that particular interface after time in seconds and we can specify the time in seconds here and this is the command for that and for that maybe if we said maybe 30 seconds or 60 seconds then this will be that port particular port will be enabled again and uh, for completeness just these three commands just uh, if you want to see the mac table entries of the switch then we can have we can use this command but this command actually once we have enabled this port security this command will not give the results of the MAC addresses which we configure after after this option so this will not this this command will not give us those results but if you want to see the MAC ad table entries which we configured after port security option so then for that case we can use this command and this command will show the MAC addresses of ports where port security has been enabled so this command will be useful was and the third command is this one so this command will actually display all the statically learned mac addresses as well as the mac addresses of the ports where we have enabled port security so this is the end for this video and thank you very much for your time hope to see you in some other video thank you